On Thursday morning, Sheriff Jesse Slaughter unveiled plans for a new school safety initiative in Cascade County. I've said for a long time that it's long overdue that we start protecting our children and our teachers and our schools like we protect our money and our banks. With several small school superintendents in attendance, Slaughter laid out his plan, which involves hiring and training armed special service officers to be placed in schools. The idea is that they would ensure the safety of teachers and students in the event of an active shooter situation and act as a deterrent to any individuals who would commit violence in local schools. The best security plan we can possibly have is a plan that makes it so the incident never occurs, and that's our goal. These officers would be paid a stipend of $80 to $100 per day. We need a person who is um, practical, safe, and can uh, deliver use of force uh, per the law and per the Constitution effectively to protect our children. That's really what we need. The plan was met with enthusiasm from superintendents in attendance. I think it's a great idea to have people in the schools that are there to protect the students and teachers. But not every person in attendance was in favor. Commissioner Don Ryan believes it should be up to the schools and the voters how to keep their schools safe, and that a vote for the upcoming public safety levy does not necessarily mean a vote for Slaughter's plan. I don't want anybody voting against this mill levy because of misinformation. Let the public decide if that's money well spent. And that's where I stand today. The public will decide if we can do this or not and we will make decisions after the money is available. Ultimately, the goal is to keep students safe, and that's common ground for everyone involved. So the sheriff has an idea. It needs to be well flushed out, taken a look at. If that's what the people want, then I think the commission will support it. Brianna Juno, MTN News.